What is up YouTube? Jacob from Bonka Bonk Studios here and today I'm going to be showing you how to change the blocks and change the texture pack you have. So t let's mess around with these blocks. So to change the type of block you have, so let's say in the download I gave you it didn't have all the blocks you wanted. So you want to have like I don't know, um, let's say you wanted to have this thing, and your blockish type thing. So, you go into edit mode by hitting tab when your cursor is over this 3D view. Now, you go into here, and you hit G, and you can move this. Uh, because we have magnet settings on, you're only able to move it every 32 blocks. So, uh, move it as close to your designated object you want it to go to as possible. Left click. And now, you're going to hit G. And hold, or not hold, but one block is 16 pixels. So, if you want it to go... Let's say, to, like we said, this one, you're going to have to go 16 pixels, so type in 1, 6 on the X, and then hit Enter, and then grab it again, and hit 1, 6 on the Y. So now it is on there, it's there, when we render it, it looks beautiful. So that's how you would change to whatever other blocks you want and blender's nice and it alphas everything out so if you wanted to like let's say if you had like a different colored glass that you made or a spider web or something you would just go over and it would alpha everything out so that way it's invisible like this glass so i didn't do anything special blender just did all that for me and moving on to the next part is the texture pack. So let's say we want a special texture pack. Download that and then hit uh, replace image. Or no, let's not, uh, let's not replace that image because you might need it if you want to go back. So just go open image and then go to where you have the texture pack. And I have that on my flash drive, but my flash drive isn't plugged in yet, and now it should go, and hold on, open image, there we go, sorry about that, so then we go to where we have our terrain image for our texture pack, so to get there, when you download it, you're going to have to go to uh, open the zip file, go to, I think it's environment or textures, and then look in, look for the terrain. And then when you find this, I got this off the line, I can't remember which one it is, but yeah, so to change all these to this texture, we go here, and we switch this picture so we go into our little texture tab uh, scroll down until we get to image so click here and then go to the image that is named got the name with your texture pack ours is terrain it's right there so it doesn't look like it changed but when we render it it's all completely changed which this is a pretty cool texture pack so, and then another thing I found out that we did wrong was with the lighting. I was just messing with that a couple seconds earlier, and uh, the shadows aren't right. So, go to your sun, and what we're supposed to do is turn this all the way up. Or actually, no, better yet, for saving rendering power, we're going to hit no shadow, and... That should just make it brighter on this side and not cause any shadows like this. Gorgeous. And 
I think that's good. So you learned how to manipulate to make custom blocks, pretty much. Like leaves and junk, so you can do all that. So now you're not limited to the blocks I just gave you, and then you're even less limited by being able to use all the texture packs you can find. Uh, in the next video, I'll be showing you how to animate your player. I said I was going to do that this video, but I thought this was more important and appropriate for finishing up looking at your scene. And thanks for watching. Subscribe and check out that next video.